Funhouse is sponsored by ExpressVPN. Your data is your business. Protect it at expressvpn.com slash funhouse. Welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Funhouse Feud. As you can see, I'm the only host this week. Pretty shocking, considering how terrible of a job I, I did it last time. But there's a very special reason. It's because this week, we have two teams that are be competing in Funhouse Feud. These two teams are Funhouse, and on the Funhouse team, we have Lindsay, Alana, and Elise, former host, now competitor. Soon to be host once again, but... But we're also very excited to have our competing visiting team, What's Good Games, with Andrea, Rihanna, Britt, and Steimer. Look at this. Yay. Thank you guys for joining us. <laughs> I think this is the first time we've gotten to do a collaboration, which is, is, this is, I feel like this is a pretty cool one though. It has nothing to do with games at all, unfortunately, but I am very excited. I have to make a declaration at the beginning of this. Funhouse Feud is not the other game show that you may be familiar with. Legally, I have to disclose that. What game show is that? that? Any mis- Yeah. I cannot what say. What was the name? Legally. <laughs> Slipping up his host. Mm. I'm glad you, you know, clarified because the production value of this versus that other show is so similar, you know? We put everything uh, into this show. Orange literally is everything color, we've so. got. But that's enough preamble. Are you guys ready to play The Feud? Yeah! Yes. 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 Dude! Cool. What we're gonna need is one member from each team come forward to compete in our first round. Yeah, that should go be you. Elise. I'll go, okay. All right, I'm ready. Elise <laughs> and Rihanna, here's our first question. Name a food you can eat with your hands. Uh, oh. Ooh, ooh, that was close. It was very close. I'm gonna be honest, I think Elise got it. I don't Elise. know, I just made a mental note that I would make the buzz sound immediately after the question was finished <laughs> reading, whether <laughs> I <laughs> <should> <laughs> <or> <laughs> <laughs> All right, Elise, your answer. Is a sandwich. Much like the sandwich I ate mere hours ago. What was the question? Show hands? me sandwich. Can you eat it with your hands? Ooh, Ooh there it is. Three. Number you three. Got three. A burger slash a sandwich. But that's okay because we know the rules. <laughs> and that means <laughs> this isn't only Elisa's game. Rihanna, do you yes. have another suggestion? I'm going to go with pizza. Show me pizza. Yeah. Oh. Oh. There it is. Nice. Number one answer. What's good games? Uh-oh. Are you going to pass or play? We are oh, going to play. Oh, we should play. play. Unexpected. Unexpected. All right. Twist. <laughs> Now's the point where the host uh, says has some fun banter. Ready Andrea, how are you doing today? <laughs> I'm doing great. Are you excited to be on the uh, feud, Legally Funhouse? I am super excited because I love this style of quiz show. I have a wealth of useless knowledge tinkering around in my head, so I'm hoping to be mm -hmm. successful today. I love to hear that kind of enthusiasm. I noticed you brought your, what is that, uh, she notepad? Has a giant size notepad? It's a, it's a, it's a whiteboard in which I'm writing down ideas. <laughs> okay, Andrea, Yes. name a food you can eat with your hands. Let's go with tacos. Show me tacos. Nice. Boom, there it is, number two answer. You got three out of the seven options on the board. Steimer, how you doing? I'm great, how are you? I noticed you don't have a board to keep your notes on. Is that intentional? It is intentional, <laughs> because I'm that kid in class that cheats off the other person. <laughs> You're on a team, right? I'm gonna uh, go with french fries. Show me french fries. Oh, oh no. Really? Oh. What? Oh my gosh, I am Everybody shocked. eats those with forks these days. <laughs> I was gonna go spoon. All right, well, that's okay. You still have two more chances here. Uh, you gotta get four more options on the board. Britt. I'm very confident. You seem very confident. No board, no nothing, nothing to keep notes, <laughs> hands free. What do you think is a food you can eat with your hands? Chicken wings. Chicken Whoa. wings. Yes. Delicious, cut, but you might spicy. Right. Oh I yes. like mine with honey and garlic. Show me chicken wings. Oh, what? oh! What is this rigged bullshit? Okay, okay. <laughs> where did you get these answers? Okay. This was a uh, survey sent out in mass to employees of Rooster Teeth. Greg Miller was not surveyed. That does explain why pizza and tacos are at the top. That's all they eat in t in Austin. Those Embrace so your Texas mm -hmm. food, re. Okay, this I believe is tough. In you. All right. Okay, um, Rihanna. Because like I could go with other Mexican food, but we already have tacos slash burritos. So I feel like that kind of covers that entire category. This may be more Southern in general, but not as Texas, but I'm gonna try barbecue. Definitely oh. Texas, gonna get your hands dirty if you're eating that barbecue. Show me barbecue. Yes! Yes! There it is. Yeah. Why is some our teeth? Are we allowed to help each other out? Yeah, yeah, you guys, okay. you guys can help each other. I'm just gonna throw out a suggestion, ladies. 
Wait, yeah. Brittany, We're, don't say it out loud, because uh, if we lose this one, it goes back to them. So you're, okay, so you <laughs> feel like you have a good so, one. Okay, point. okay. We have a pretty good list here. I, I feel confident about one of these, but I feel like a universal hand food that people enjoy has got to be donuts. I think we okay. ate donuts together the last time I saw you, Andrea. Do you remember that large donut that we ate? That giant really donut. Oh, yeah. You ever see those people that eat their desserts with the knife and fork? Freaks! Monsters. Show me donuts! Oh, wow. oh man. Okay. This is a tough one. I gotta be honest with you, this is a tough one. There's only seven responses there, and I can think off the top of my head a thousand things you eat with your hands. So, so that means we're gonna pass it on over to Funhouse. What right. are we thinking here? Bread bowls? Okay, so Ooh. my first thing that I was thinking was like chips. Chips has been my number one the whole I, time, too. I thought chips or like a like a chocolate bar. Lindsay, you wanna take it? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. This is making me really hungry. Bob, we're gonna go with chips. Let's see. Chips! No, no, no chips. Oh, yeah, no no chips. Woo. What's good games what? gets the points. I'm so curious as to what these other ones are. Yeah, they not show. Yeah. I have I on, my, on my list, I've got cookies, peanuts, chicken fingers, ice cream cone. I think hot dog is a good one. But oh, We got cookies. So. There uh, were cookies, cookies there. We did have fruit <laughs> oh, was what? on there. I, was going oh, to say Texas. I mean, I guess I've never seen so many fruit in this. And this one, which I thought was a little strange, sushi. We got some savages. With their hands? Hands? What? That is one of the things you definitely do not eat with your hands. There's a whole utensil you, for it. The idea that sushi that. with oh. your hand is above chicken wings is sacrilege. Oh, at least you got your dry erase board. I got a board from my list. I got a wall. <laughs> oh, Everyone, grab something large that you can write on to only keep track of things for yourself. Here's this picture I drew of Mario <laughs> as a sex offender. How is that different than Mario? Yeah, that's redundant. <laughs> All right, we got some points on the board. It's Again, it's still anyone's game. We're gonna do one more round of this, and then after that, the points will be doubled oh. because I'm crazy. Who are our next two? Andrea and... Uh, I guess Alba. Uh, what's the most important thing you do in the bathroom? <gasps> buzz. Oh, I saw a buzz. You poop. That's Dang. the most important thing, James. <laughs> Andrea says poop. <laughs> yeah. Yes! Yeah. Yeah, it's the toilet, number one. Play, play, a little bit play, classier. Play, play. A little play. bit classier. That is a little right. classier. And that uh, encompasses right. both number one and number two, so. All right, we're playing it. Stimer. Use the shower. Okay, we're jumping right into it. Show me use the shower. I was going to banter. Yes! yes. I'm like, I've played The Sims. I know what they need to do in there. All right, hey, Britt. Brit, you're up. Britt, you got the X last time. Yeah, okay. I did. Yeah, it's fucked but up. But your team right now has the one and the two. What's the most important thing you do in the bathroom? You wash your hands. Yes! Wash yes. your hands. In the time of COVID. There we go. Love the enthusiasm. There we go. Show me wash your hands. What? No, oh, nobody. Man. Sorry. What is going on at the Rooster Teeth Company? Eating sushi with with unwashed hands? Really? You need to introduce me to your lawyer. Rihanna, mm -mm. you got one X on the board. Yeah. Okay. okay. Still plenty of space there. Plenty of things you can do in the bathroom. I spend most of my day in there, frankly. What do you think right. is the most important thing you do in the bathroom? I'm gonna discuss with my team here just a little bit because. Oh. Mm -mm. Okay. okay. Judging by the population that was surveyed, I'm wondering if the hygiene here sucks. Let's be real. But yeah. there is one key There's hygiene element that you do twice a day that we think might be a shoe up. You already said poop. I'm gonna go with brushing your teeth. <laughs> they brushing say no. Teeth. If this is an X, I'm gonna have some serious questions about the people who were pulled for this. <laughs> I already have some questions about them, but for now, let's see if they brush their teeth. Show me brush your teeth. Okay. Yes, there, there it is. is. Okay. Number three. It's only going to get harder from here, right? Andrea, back to you. I've been stewing about this, knowing that we've knocked off the greatest hits of what people do in the bathroom. <laughs> but another big one that my husband does every day in the bathroom is shave. Like a man with a nice, clean shave, you know, the smooth face. I don't believe in it personally. <laughs> but let's see. For people that are better than me, shaving. Oh. No wow. Wow. No wow. Rooster teeth Hipsters shaves? in Austin, they love their oily beards. Yeah, yeah but they they still gotta, you still gotta do beard you gotta like, maintenance. You gotta maintenance that stuff, man. Oh. Big unkempt mess, like mm. a beehive coming out of your chin. I mean, listen, people should be washing their hands. They should be shaving mm -hmm. in the bathroom. It's not us, ladies. It's them, okay? You're right. <laughs> Remember You're right. that. Yeah. These are good answers. Yes. Okay. I, should, I should emphasize, you know, the question has you in it, but the you is not you. Mm. It's them. All right. 
Yeah. You got two X's. Steimer, how are you feeling about this? When you feel confident in I your mean, answer? No, because I don't I don't understand these people. And wash your face? Yeah, like yeah. I don't know. James like washes his face with the loofah that he washes his oh, ass no. with. Oh, okay. I mean, but, just, but he's okay. still so, doing it, right? With that knowledge, I will allow you to suggest a different <laughs> answer. <laughs> he has like perfect skin though. It's all that ass. Well, it's like how people drink probiotics. I just put ass mm. bacteria on my face, mm. cleans everything right mm. up. Can you sell that in a bottle? My not? ass bacteria? <laughs> what do you got? Final answer. Different show, but final answer. Maybe hair. Hair. Uh, I'll say blow dry your hair or do your hair. Do you do your hair? Mm. Yes. Yes. yes! yes! There we yes. go. Still in it, but you got the two X's. You got the two do, X's, you're still in it though. All right, like, we only have two more two more answers though. It's do like we want to lean into the woman the woman aspect of it here? Yeah, that's, I think maybe. I think so. As the only man on this call, I'm gonna say lean, ladies. Check your makeup. Check your makeup. Do it. Do your do makeup. You got your the makeup. big mirror, Check you makeup. might as well yeah. use it. Very unflattering lighting. Let me see myself <laughs> how I look when I put on that makeup. Oh, I'm no, running out, so you guys gotta be running so out too, man. Close, Woo. Yeah. Woo. so close. All right, so Ree, yeah, I'm, yeah. I'm, unless you got one in the in the wings, I want to hear what you think. What you hear, hear you think about if we want to take the risk on wash your face. I'm worried about wash your face. Yeah. Okay. What about what about like moisturizer? <laughs> Put on moisturizer. No. I'm, I'm worried about skincare when shaving yeah. isn't even on the list. Feels like, like it's cry is. <laughs> <laughs> I have that on my board. I have cry. <laughs> check your phone. Um, yeah, check your yeah, phone. So first. I have, I have like, yeah, I have like play games, TikTok on your phone. I feel like the phone, yeah, playing phone. on the phone might be a good one. No one's mentioned avoid confrontation. Hide. To hide. To be alone. Yeah. I'm going to go with being on your phone. I am worried about my legs falling asleep because I spent all that time checking my phone. Oh, Ow. Oh, Good try. Dang it. Go. We did so good on this one. And well, it's not over because they have to if get Team Funhouse correct. can't get this number six answer, those points go right back to you. Something only five people would have said. The only one <laughs> that I had on my list that hasn't been done, which I don't think is very good, but everything else is crossed off, is get changed. The only other one I had was yeah. trimming your nails. But I had clipped nails as well. Mm -hmm. Using nails or changing? Um, I also did have cry, though, and if I know the women at Rooster Teeth, like, I think I do. <laughs> <laughs> that, do that, a lot. that might be. Nails are changing. Like, changing is good. Okay, yeah. let's, we're going to attempt... Getting, getting changed. You don't like how you look. You take it to the bathroom, change your shirt, maybe change your pants. You're getting dressed. Oh! Oh! There, wow. Yes. <laughs> wow. Oh, I made a lot of writing on that. That was yeah. good, Alana. I gotta That's give you props. Good job, Alana. Yeah, well done. Oh, well done. That was close. I'm gonna say a lot of great suggestions there, all things that it seems that people would logically do. And I think it's an implied that crying is like involved in all those anyways. Yeah, you can cry during <laughs> any of this. That's just a secondary activity Have you ever done a good else? shower cry? That is underrated. Uh, wash your hands, rooster teeth. Let's keep moving on though. We still got two more rounds. All right. Questions. And for these rounds, these points will be doubled. It is still extremely close. We're gonna double the points. Who are are going to be our guessers? So we had Alana. So it'd be Lindsay and Britt. Brit. Are you guys ready to buzz or raise your hand? Just okay. screech. Fill in the blank. James Willems is the blank guy around. Blank. I mean, I okay. said blank, but I meant to say buzz. Okay. I heard Lindsay say blank, so I'm going to go with Lindsay. I'm going to go default what people would say, like in a YouTube comment, and say uh, strongest. Very flattering. Very flattering. I'm not saying it. I've read it. I appreciate what you're saying, Lindsay, how you've decided to fill in the blank with your <laughs> thoughts and opinions. Uh, I think Lindsay might be trying to cuddle up to the host. I'm just going to say that. I think the host may have made this round uh, with <laughs> specifically female contestants so he can just get a bunch of compliments from a bunch of hot girls. What happens if both teams pass on playing? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's that? unprecedented and I will not allow it. <laughs> <laughs> what if right. we purposely throw the round and we all get strike out by saying really bad things? <laughs> that doesn't work in with the status of the rules. Show me James Willems is the strongest. <laughs> what? <laughs> Number one answer. No. Number one answer. Pass or play. Fun house. All right, we're going to play. Just play. Just okay. Play. Jeez. Come on. <laughs> Elise, you're up, Elise. James Willems is the funniest. That's the only other Guy one that I have. Around. Seven attributes are up there, Alana. There are seven attributes. 
that people <sighs> say describe me. But are they all positive? They have to be. I mean, they must, right? <laughs> <laughs> Show me funniest. Hold on. No one laughed. No Crickets. one laughed. At that. <laughs> We're also trying to figure care. out what's going on over here. You guys are really doing it. You guys do a great job over here. I don't have any more answers for you. We got his whole personality down. I mean, I'm sure somebody said, like, nice. No one on this call. Uh, we'll go with nice. People love him, think he's funny. <laughs> but is he nice? He is ah. nice. <laughs> Hello. The okay, game has you proven- not, You are not more nice than you are funny. This, this is all backwards. <laughs> <laughs> Still got four more to go. I know what you're thinking. Only four? At least maybe, do you think like clever or like, uh, or smart? Think, is that better to go I think with smartest clever? is an easy bet. I also think people would say most hardworking. Oh, hard, that's yeah. good. Most okay, hardworking. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, we got a lot of good answers here. I'm gonna get, if maybe these ones are bad and we'll get them out of the way, I'm gonna go with- um, clever or smart. Just right? because we think they would have said that, not because we think they would. Show me how clever is this host. Oh. Uh, <laughs> very. Not smart? James, Nobody not said smart. smart. Not smart or okay. clever. Right. I would argue that clever and smart are not okay. the same thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're next, Elise. Um, Come on, you got it. Like, att like attractive, good looking. Ooh, handsome. Yeah, I'm thinking if you surveyed Blaine, that is definitely mm. on. <laughs> yeah. It's list. like one vote. So Blaine, what, it, what is it? Me. If you could fill in the blank, how would it read? James Willems is the most handsome man around. <laughs> You're already <laughs> married. She could barely <laughs> get this out. Show me James Willems is handsome. <laughs> <laughs> no, I hate to see it. <laughs> Not. Wait, yeah, is this actually it. helping your not ego, or board, is it making it handsome. worse? I don't know. Alana, what was the other one that you said before? I said most hardworking. I feel like I, I can imagine yeah, people no. at RT saying Wow. Like, could any be negative, though? Even in jest, could any be negative? Mm -hmm. I mean, I don't see why. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, probably. He probably got, like, dumb to contrast the smart. People would have said stupid, dumb. Stupid. Yeah. Stupid. Like, just like this, like... Beefcake, stupid mean person. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna guess hardworking. He kills himself every day of his life to entertain you. Is this boy hardworking? No. Not at all. <laughs> <laughs> this is oh, tough. Wow. He's just the worst. <laughs> I feel so bad for what's good game. I was gonna be upset that you strategically placed a question about yourself in the rounds with double points, but now we have an opportunity here, and I have a list here that okay, let's hear it. you know we gotta pick one, and it's gotta be right. So let's have a little chat, ladies, All before right, we pick an answer. So my quick list was smarmiest, dumbest, mm. cheapest, mm. angriest, most generous, or coolest. When you said the sentence, granted, I'm sorry, I don't know you, but I was just like, <laughs> generically, if I'm thinking of anybody, I'd just be like, they're the coolest person around. Yeah, sure. yeah, 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 yeah. Like, why not? Because it, mean, it essentially means nothing, but it also means something. Or number seven just says, who is James Willems? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think, Ree? What do you think? I think coolest sounds good. I was also thinking maybe just another generic one being best. I think either or, but I, whatever your gut is telling you, ladies, feel it in your yeah. gut. Did you, have another, did you have another word that we hadn't contemplated? I was going to say creepy to be funny, but no. <laughs> <laughs> well, so far, all of these have been nice things. Yeah, which makes me feel yeah. like coolest. So I feel like in tandem with I that. feel like coolest is the way to go. Yeah, yeah let's go with all coolest. Right. Everyone at What's Good Games thinks I'm the coolest. Are they right? <laughs> uh, yes! yes! <laughs> Two. There it is. Big. We got all the points. Big points. <laughs> uh, other <laughs> options on the board. We had weirdest, okay. most confident, and most humble. Oh, oh those are good. In contrast there. Dichotomy. It's still anyone's game. I think it's gonna it's gonna come down to whoever takes this next round. This is the final round of Funhouse Feud. Everyone has been playing spectacularly. I feel like you will not have to worry about it necessarily being specific to anyone. Who are our two? So Steimer it's me. I'm and it's back to Elise. Yeah. Back to Elise. So here is your final question. Name a throwback TV show you love to watch. Oh. oh. I, I, saw, I saw the buzz. No, you didn't. No, no, no buzzing? All right, Elise. No, you heard Elise wait, wait before I said anything. Friends, that's for Lindsay. That's for, for Lindsay, the only person here, I'm sure, who's watched Friends. Show me Friends. Ah, number one. Number nice. one answer. People nice love All friends. Right. They do. Love to have them. Wish I had a couple myself. <laughs> hey, you got some people who think you're cool. Elise. We're gonna Are you gonna play? pass or play? 
you guys want to pass or play? No, we gotta play, man. Eight, eight, eight answers. Gotta play. This is eight tough, answers though. I'm not here. gonna be much help here. You don't watch TV? What's wrong with you? Well, I grew up in a different country, you know? So we watch different stuff, I think. Like, neighbors. Yeah, you're gonna say, like, Dinky the Kangaroo Yeah, or right? Skippy, actually. <laughs> Might um, be on the board. Might be on the board. Could be. The Office, is it old enough to count as a throwback show? I think so. Mm. Like, I feel like it's on people's minds in any case, so I'm gonna go with The Office. All right. That's a good guess. People That's a good guess. People love to watch The Office. Michael Scott, what a wacky host of the show, kind of. Mm -hmm. Show me the office. Mm. Oh no. I'm gonna say, right. I'm gonna go with another 90s classic and I'm gonna go Seinfeld. That's a good mm. one, yeah. That's good Seinfeld. One. Do people still love Seinfeld? No. Number two. Okay, they do. Okay. New York City, common thread. Frasier? What do you guys think about Oh, Frasier? that's another good I one. I mean, I love Frasier, but I don't know if it's popular enough. Oh, 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 oh. Fresh Prince. Oh, that's, that's a good, good one. That's good. Fresh Prince of Bel Air, James. Went from Philadelphia to Los oh, Angeles, memory. changed his whole life. Carlton does the wacky dance. Show me the Fresh Prince. Ooh, yes. nice guess, Elise. Yes. Wow, number three. three. Okay. Okay, good guess. It's gonna get tougher, it's getting tougher. Do you think The Simpsons counts, despite it yes. still being a rejection? But I feel like people you know love what? old Simpsons, right? Do that. All right, yeah. The Simpsons. The Simpsons, still on the air, but it's also way back from way when, because it's 100 years old. Show me The Simpsons. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, I'm surprised. Oh, that's, I thought that was a good one, for sure. It was on our on list. There. Oh, I got a good one. I got a good one. I'm gonna go with Cheers. Cheers. Okay. Sam, he loves his bar. <laughs> Other things about the show. <laughs> <laughs> show me Cheers. Dang it. Oh, wow. Thinking, okay. Is this fucking awesome people? Throwback? Is that too much throwback? Did I throw it back too far? Okay, this is for Basically the whole game. Oh shit. Oh, you God. guys need to steal this with one of the possible answers. You got five possible answers on the board. A throwback TV show people love to watch. You just need one of them to take the whole game. Okay, ladies, I, we have we have a couple ideas. I have I have uh, a couple too. What, what okay, Re, Re, what do you got? Sex in the City. Um, mm -hmm. and Saved by the Bell. Saved um, by the Bell is also on our list, but we also have on my list Frasier as well, which they didn't use, which is, I think, a good one. Uh, we have Full House, which is, oh. a, is amazing. Right? They did mm. a Netflix revival, so that means it's gotta be popular. People know who it is. They got Fuller House. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I also have Family Matters, Saved by the Bell, and Home Improvement. I'm thinking Saved by the Bell, but I'm also really scared. <laughs> I'm well, like, I think about what's that? on TV, and I'm one of the few people left with cable. <laughs> um, <laughs> and Full House is on constantly. So. Yeah. I would say either Frasier or Full House. Even I watched Full House back in the day. And I don't Let's watch go TV. Timer? Okay. We're, we're, go, we're going Full House. Is it Full House, James? Show me Full House. Oh, oh, wow. wow. What the heck's on there? Wings. Yeah, what is on there? <laughs> that oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Wings was a <laughs> great Quantum show. Quantum Leap. Is it I Quantum Leap? I've watching. Yeah. But what are they Here's watching? I had. gotta know. Here's what we had on show the board. Show me X-Files. We had <laughs> Golden Girl. Oh, damn. Shit How did we overlook that? We How did we overlook that? Buffy. Oh, oh. Buffy. oh. it's a bunch of nerds. So yeah, makes yes. sense. Uh, makes yeah. sense. Makes sense. Okay. Nine oh two one zero. I was thinking about oh. getting get out of here. I forgot ah. about that show. Okay. Family Matters. Oh. Probably referring to up until those later seasons where uh, Stefan Urkel takes <laughs> over the show. And then last on the list, Saved by the Bell. Damn. Damn Told it. you, Saved by the Bell was uh, gonna be our Damn Everyone it. was Give circling, it everyone was yeah. circling. We were, in the, we were in the area. That was a very yeah. strong list. So you guys had, had definitely some options on there. Again, Wacky Texas, you never know what they're gonna come <laughs> up with. This was an incredibly close game. The final score is 225 to 234, Funhouse wins. <laughs> Wow. First win. By, yeah, I think that, well, it's their second episode. First yeah. win. <laughs> so that means we lost and now we won. <laughs> but, I mean, I wish we could go back and count the number of ones that Funhouse got, because I feel like What's Good Games maybe got more of these actual lists. <laughs> Do all the work and none Don't of the worry credits. about it. Semantics. Story Semantics. Of our lives. Yeah. But then Sorry. that double score kicks in. This is extremely close. I think everyone played very, very well. I'm also going to add that everyone added a lot of answers that probably should have been on the board, but weren't. Please wash your hands. Really in that bathroom hands. category. Mm -hmm. And the, the finger Don't food category. Sushi. What are they doing? Thank you guys, What's Good Games, for coming on the show, joining us, and hopefully you had a good time. Where can people find more of you guys? The easiest place to find us, of course, is whatsgoodgames.com. You can download our podcast on your favorite podcast app of your choice. You can watch us on YouTube at youtube.com slash whatsgoodgames. We 
We stream live on Twitch every Monday at 11 a.m. Pacific time at twitch.tv slash what's good games. You can catch everything we're doing on Twitter at what's good underscore games. That's so awesome. Thank you guys for coming on. We'd love to see you guys on more stuff, not just Funhouse Feud. Um, Please, please keep in touch. Lindsay, where can people find you? Crying in the bathroom. (laughs) We'll see you next time. I have to go cry over those backhanded compliments from earlier. Bye, everybody. (laughs) Bye.